Live, local, late breaking. This is WTVA 9 News. 30 shots fired. A girl hit by a bullet, a neighborhood on edge. It's a crime sheriff's deputies in Knoxville County want to solve right now, but they need your help. WTVA's Garner Montgomery is live near Macon with an update. Yeah, this scary incident happened down this road Monday morning on Cedar Creek Road. A teenager sleeping in her bed was grazed by a bullet. And here in this video, we'll show you what car was driving through in that area and those gunshots. And surveillance video shows this car speeding past the area about 20 seconds after 30 rounds were fired in just about six seconds. Investigators with the Knoxville County Sheriff's Department are still looking for the people driving this car. You can see where the bullets punched through this home. There are bullet holes everywhere across the entire length of the house from one window shutter to another. Some rounds even went through the other side of the home, damaging the backyard window. I talked with the family there at the scene. They did not want to speak on camera, but they did tell me the girl who was grazed by the bullet is okay. But the sound of the gunfire has left the entire neighborhood on edge. It was like three o'clock in the morning and all I heard was gunshots and my first reaction was to just get down on the floor. Pop, 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 pop. Just none stopped. Seemed like they shot about 50 or 60 rounds before they stopped. And you just, I just laid there. I was paralyzed. And here's another look at the car investigators are looking for. If you know anything about this case, this is video captured on the corner of Cedar Creek Road and Prairie Point Road. If you know anything about this case, please call the Knoxville County Sheriff's Office. I'm going to have more reaction from people around here who are very nervous about recent incidents of gunshots here in this Cedar Creek community. I'll have more on that at 10. Coming to you live from Knoxville County, Gordon Montgomery, WTVA 9 News.